Hey YouTube, I just want to direct you guys to check a video out. Um, it's called Here's Your Collusion with Russia. And it's made by Headlines of the Voice. I suggest you guys subscribe to this channel. No comments allowed or anything, but uh, she comes up with some really, really good stuff. Now this particular video is talking about how Homeland Security is basically kicked uh, China out of Long Beach Harbor. And um, I'm sure they could still use it, but uh, as far as ownership and having as much control as they had, they, they can't do that anymore for security reasons. But here's the rub. Um, she goes further into explaining um, that um, Russia's basically doing the same thing in Virginia. And she's asking the question why no one's talking about that. And the name of the group is called uh, Gulf Tainer. And if you look here, you see, if you can recognize what this is, they're shipping these containers in. And um, if you know what that is, I mean, those are... <laughs> should, should I say, I mean, I hate to use the word because I don't want to get flagged, but those are missiles. And she says that they've shipped a lot of these things into the country. No one knows where they are. Now, with that said, um, if you go to Revelation 18, um, it flat says America will burn in one hour. One hour. And gee, you know, there's been all kinds of prophecies to that effect. Henry Groover's done them. David Wilkerson's done them. Uh, Dimitri Dudeman, Dudeman's done them. A lot of people have had dreams and visions. Even our good buddy Cleck has talked about uh, what's going to hit New York. So I don't think it's a big mystery as far as what's coming to Mystery Babylon. Um, I think that uh, America is Mystery Babylon. And uh, so you guys definitely might want to check that out and subscribe. Also, real quick, I got a, a message uh, in my comments from a fella, and he's talking about, he was talking about, Clack is doing the same thing, you know, with Adam, uh, or, or Satan did the same thing with Adam as, as Clack's doing. I says, well, I think you're right as far as Eve goes. Because what Kleck is doing is pushing the original lie. I just want to point this verse out and I'm going to close. Um, this is uh, 1 Timothy 2.9. And it says, And Adam was not deceived, but the woman being deceived was in the transgressions. So basically, you know, what that means is Eve fell for Satan's lie, you should be as gods. And that's the lie that Kleck is pushing. You know, we're gods, we're gods, we're gods, and we're not gods. Uh, he's using that strong coordinates. And he's twisting the facts. And, and this points that out. Plus, it also points out uh, that it was deception, not seduction. So it wasn't a sexual thing. Because it was a, if it was a sexual thing, um, then Adam would have been deceived as well because he ate of the fruit too. So if eating a fruit equals having sex, as Kleck teaches and these serpent cedars teach, then since Adam ate of the same fruit that Eve did, then Adam would have been seduced or deceived, see? So that's just proof positive that Kleck smoking crack and with that, we'll call it a day. And um, I just want to point that video out to you. Please check that out. Hope you subscribe to that channel. And for those that have helped Michelle with uh, the funeral arrangements for her daughters, I really, really appreciate it. Hopefully you're sharing the video and, and you're doing what you can.
for them. All right. Love you. And if I can do anything for you, please let me know. God bless you now. Bye-bye.